The kidney, na two organs for the body, we get the shape of beans, and each of them na about the size of one hand folded together. What in the kidney they do, na to filter the blood, come out waste, control fluid balance. Now this extra waste they come out like peace for the body. Kidney self as they function, get some kind of disease where they affect them. Some of them now, kidney stones, polycystic kidney disease, chronic kidney disease, and urinary tract infection. When person get kidney disease, the kidneys go get problem and it no go fit filter blood well. It they also reduce the person's ability to stay healthy. International Society of Nephrology don't report say now more than 850 million people worldwide get one type of kidney disease or another. This one now double of the number of people where they live with diabetes will be 422 million and 20 times more than people will get cancer worldwide at 42 million or people where they live with HIV AIDS 36.7 million. Another report don't also talk say more than 15% of the U.S. adults, that is about 37 million people, get chronic kidney disease. It is 38% more common for people with the age of 65, 12% for people with the age of 45 to 64, and 6% for 18 to 44 years. And slightly more common for women will be 14%, and men will be 12%. For Nigeria, Study don't show say the case of kidney disease they between 1.6 and 12.4 percent range. For 2017, Nigeria been ranked number four for countries where get the disease. Health experts been talk say out of 25 million people we get kidney failure. Now about 18,000 go need dialysis every year, and this now about 100 per 1 million of the population. Person will get kidney disease if no no say he gets until he come the worse. Some things we go let you know say you don't they get this disease. Now if you not sleep for nights, if you they day tired all the time, if you get dry skin, and if you they pee every time, especially for nights and many others. Treatment for any kind of kidney disease fee be dialysis or kidney transplants. As this disease they expensive to treat. Early detection will help prevent the way the sickness will grow before it reach kidney disease or kidney failure. People feel prevent them if they feel manage the risk factors, come treat them so it will slow the rates when they progress and reduce the risk of complications. If they keep their blood pressure below 140 over 90 mmHg or targets where the doctor establish. Person will get diabetes, make his stay him target blood sugar range as much as possible. You they do physical activity as this will help control blood pressure and blood sugar levels. Them do regular checkup if them they the risk to get chronic kidney disease. If person where they smoke stop them, as smoking feel worsen kidney disease and it will interfere with medication where they lower blood pressure. Person where don't already get them, make you avoid Products will get added salts, limit the amount of protein in the chop, maintain a moral routine, stay active with regular exercise. All right, welcome back. Now, to the Good Morning Niger Show. Yes, we say make we drop that package for now because this is not the matter we want to discuss this morning and about your kidney. Because sometimes when people they talk about kidney, they, they, people just don't want to talk about them because they don't want to even hear waiting if they cost anything for there. But from the reports where you don't see, you don't see the percentage, the amount of people where they, uh, where they carry this kidney disease for body and then the ones we uh, they very very um, prone to the get all these kind of things but today we get a very uh, better guest who will help us break down some of the questions and if you get questions self uh, be like say we feel open phone lines for now make on call us make on ask a guy himself uh, which kind of question they touch you for body regarding this kidney matter now dr theophilus uh, umwe zudike uh, will be consultant transplant physician and neurologist uh, department of medicine for loot doctor good morning Morning, sir. How are I, you today? I did. Yeah, good Galax. morning, doctor. I did here with Ochuko, and then we'll go choke mouth on top of this matter uh, this morning with you. Yeah, good morning, doctor. Good morning, again, sir. All right. Okay, we could just sharply jump enter the matter one by four. First of all, more fair establish what is the kidney 
and where kidney day for inside the body. Yeah, so maybe that will go understand make people know as they go. Before we start to ask the question, they go. All right, thank you for having me on your show. I have, I hope my feet speak English. I've been a broke now to speak. You feel they mix up? Uh, just the any other kind of way you understand they mix that. Go. Okay, so um, I think I need to come back to uh, the situation where I work. I work at Lagos State University Teaching Hospital. Mm -hmm. Uh, mm -hmm. And then uh, I'm a consultant, nephrologist, transplant physician. Mm -hmm. So essentially, coming back to your question, sir, uh, the kidneys, a day two inside most people's body, and mm -hmm. usually they are the place way they behind, mm -hmm. just below your chest or the back. And the way God comes and for that place, say, if they protected by strong muscle for your back, so that no go they easily injured or small thing happen, you go get injured. Mm -hmm. And most people, when they want them, they want them with two kids. Some people, very few, it gets just one kidney as they want them. Mm -hmm. And usually, as God, they do in feeding. Those two kidneys be sustained person for life as long as something no happens to any of them. Mm -hmm. And the person will get one kidney too, will live with one kidney all through the lifetime as long as something also no happens to that kidney. Okay. So um, that's the way it is. Sir. All right. Uh, a good thing you don't help us break them down so people fit to live with one kidney. If not, so they take care and come. And so make we even look at the situations around kidney and the diseases where we don't face. With the statistics that we see, we see some kind of conversations with it. So make we just jump straight into the matter. How person fit take care of in kidney? What will be the things where you need to do first? Or, or then we go come enter the things where you no need to do at all. So make we just start from what you need to do to make sure you take care of your kidney. Okay, so to care for one's kidneys, you go know, say, they work way God do. Like uh, some people will say, we are fearfully and wonderfully made. Mm -hmm. Okay, so if you look at the amount of blood in the entire the kidney, about 25% of what is come up from the heart. And if you look at the total work where the kidney they do, the amount of uh, thing where the kidney they filter, they reach about. 120 liters, but at the end of the day, the body will come out just about two liters of that 120. It means say that two kidney, God will can be such a way that it's highly efficient and able to accommodate so much work in a single day. No matter how much water we person drink, the person will still pass out a significant amount of that water. Mm -hmm. So. I will start by saying, let us ensure we drink enough water. We will still say our environment is very hot. Okay? As it is hot, so it may say, apart from sweat, also peace. And those are the two ways, of course. Another way we make water go fit come up from one body. The main way is to peace. The other way is to sweat. Mm -hmm. And the other way is to lift in and out. But the one who will go and say, maybe the is well, well. So make sure you drink enough water. But before you start to drink enough water, make sure you don't go do tests which sure say your two kidneys stay okay. Hmm. Right? Because in a for somebody we get two kidneys, we advise that they can drink between 2.5 to 3 liters of water. If they drink that one every day, it's very unlikely that they could get something where they call kidney stone. But aside from that, it also makes them cleanse their body well because people will talk about cleansing, body cleansing. Mm -hmm. But that is what is the easiest way and the cheapest way to cleanse your body. As you drink it off, your kidneys remove what uh, is like toxins in the body. Mm -hmm. And also, as you make sure, say, in the job, you know they add too much salt to your food. You no, know they put too much salt for food. That, Yes, hmm. doing that will reduce the risk of getting hypertension hmm. because the way will be black, we don't 
get the way where we say if we chop small salt, our BP feet go on like white people. So for us blacks, as much as possible, maybe not they add extra salt when we chop. Maybe we do our best to also make sure, say, with the chop, the food may not contain plenty of salt. Mm. And the best way to do that one is say, you go cook your own food yourself. That one has done business with some people. Okay. But that is the way where we fit to them so that people don't get to keep it for them too much. All right. If they chop so much outside, the dance is to say, the chop plenty of salt. Okay, no control. You're not going to know the quantity yeah. with chop the outside. The food, Doctor. The chop the food. Yeah, Doctor. Um, yeah, but, yeah, let's, let me hear your question. Yeah, um, you don't tell us some of the preventive measures, things so we know what they do. But I will just take you back a little bit. Make we know the functions of the kidney. What the kidney they do for person body. Then moving forward, you don't talk um, the things so we know what they do. But what about all these things so you talk say we know what they do? If we they do, what will be the result of them? Um, so two questions that I marry for one. The functions and what are the results of all which you don't ask us now? You don't talk, say, more we know they do. Right, so, the functions of the kidneys, like I talked about, ability to maintain the body water, no matter how much, as long as say, your food is still okay, no matter how much water we you drink, your kidneys to make sure it remove the excess. Right? So, that is one function of the kidney to maintain. The water so that it is not too much or too less. Okay. And the but the kidneys they also maintain pH so that the body will not take too much acid or too much alkali. It will maintain and maintain the pH of about 7.4. And then the kidney they also make sure say when um, we take in things. Okay, it's able to remove it, what we call nitrogenous waste, which the body generates and is able to make sure that those things don't go up in the body. It is when those things begin to go up in the body that person may get kidney problems, the can be sick. Hmm. And the kidneys they also produce what they call some hormone. Hormone be say one chemical away to produce one part of the body. The whole can act on that part of the body. So it produces common, two of them mainly. One is called hydroquetin or hippo for short. That's hippo, we say, it they help us to produce blood. They help the bone marrow to produce blood. Mm. So as long as our kidneys, they work well, well, it will produce those erythropoietin. We will go stimulate the bone marrow to produce blood. And it also produce something called another hormone called calcitonin, which enables or castrior, or castrior, if they enable the bone to stay healthy, mm -hmm. but make sure, say, your bone is not too strong or too soft. And then the kidney, they also make sure, say, when they uh, take some harmful substances, like some medications, when they drink, the kidneys will make sure they come out. Any medications that from kidneys, they come out. Hmm. That's why when person get kidney problem, it's very necessary to say to see doctor so that they go adjust some of the dose of the drug way to take. Then also, um, when we look at the fact that there is so many things where the kidneys are true, we need to look at those conditions where it affects the kidneys. Mm -hmm. okay? We call them risk factors. I don't talk about number one, we have yeah. potential. Potential they affect about Thirty percent of Nigerians. Mm -hmm. Studies don't show say between twenty to forty percent. On the average, you can say about thirty percent of Nigerians. That means say if you see ten Nigerians, maybe adults, about three of them fit get blood pressure, high blood pressure. Mm -hmm. And like on the top, one of the stats, one forty or ninety is cut off. Although when would they use that uh, speed? Where would they use battery to uh, measure for house? The cutoff is actually a bit lower because that one is more sensitive than the one where they used before. So the cutoff for that one be one thirty five over eighty five. Mm -hmm. Okay, and so that brings the figure a bit lower, makes it much more important for people to check their BP and make sure say they know they are higher than that, right? And of course, BP don't say once you see them, say they are high above that one thirty five over eighty five, the person don't get hypertension. No. 
need to measure it again and make okay. sure say it is sustained and it is high more than two times before we say this person gets pension. So we need to check out more than affects, three times to confirm. Now what do you talk, sir? At least more than two times. At least more than two high and they go come down. Okay. Okay, and the doctor, yeah. I would just like to ask this question. Uh, you make uh, one statement earlier about the fact, say, okay, uh, human beings, most people, they get two kidneys, and only some exceptional cases, they get one. So for a person who get two kidneys, is it possible, say, the person will survive with one, if one don't get issue? Say, is it possible, say, the person will live life completely? Or uh, if one don't get problem like that, it don't affect the whole system? All right, so a good question, sir. Um, there are people where maybe they get accidents, mm. accident, and something goes through their stomach on into their kidney. That kidney has to be removed by operation. Mm -hmm. Those people live with just one kidney. Okay? We get some patients also where don't get cancer for one kidney. We come out that kidney, we get cancer. Mm -hmm. And they are living with one kidney. Okay. There are also people who get something, one disease for one kidney, where it means say they need to remove that kidney. And they are living with one thing. Hmm. So, in essence, God gave us two, but one of them can sustain somebody's life for many, many years. Okay. Okay. Great. 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 Okay, doctor, to wrap it up, eh, um, they said Nigeria will be ranked four for countries who get this very disease of kidney. Percy will get this very disease. How if he take no? Say, it be like, say, my kidney, though, they be as he gets. So, what will be the signs mm -hmm. we're supposed to show you? Okay, so those studies and those uh, figures when they project, it's by projecting the spectrum of kidney diseases. Okay, so uh, we stage kidney disease from stage one to stage two, three to stage four to stage five. Usually, the people will get uh, the most number go fall for that stage one and two. Those people don't get symptoms. Okay, so they fit get hypertension and they don't know. Mm. They fit get diabetes, they don't know. They also fit get some other conditions, to kidney problem like HIV, sickle cell, uh, the one we want to mention, polycystic kidney disease, mm -hmm. or some other women condition. They call it uh, systemic lupus erythematosus or lupus for short. Any of these uh, conditions fit puts person at risk. Of kidney problem, so mm. they go this stage one or stage two. Those people usually they don't they don't get symptoms. They will just the water and no water. Okay, but it's only when they go do tests to check. Maybe they check their BP mm. or they check their blood glucose mm -hmm. or they check their urine and they will see what they call protein or blood. So any of the people who get any of these conditions, whether it's hypertension or diabetes or sickle cell, or HIV, or hepatitis B or C, or lupus, they should also check their kidney function from time to time. Because the fit gets kidney problem, they don't get symptoms. Just like a potential, they don't get symptoms for the early stage. Hmm. Now, when the kidney condition don't reach stage 3, stage 4, and stage 5, yeah. nine person they get symptoms. So from the past stage 3, person really gets so to say, if they wake up for night, up to three, four, five, six times, go peace. If they pace over and over again. Say, mm, okay. From about stage three, I went to the best symptom. So some people will notice say that they wake up in the middle of the night, mm -hmm. like three, four, five, six times, go peace. Okay. But I must make, I must also put a proviso. As long as the person doesn't drink water too much for evening before they go to sleep. Because if a person drink one full bottle of water before he sleep, he will wake up most peaceful. Okay. So at the time, if they, they won't drink water, they will not drink beyond 6, 7 p.m. So that when they sleep, they are not going to wake up to go peace. But as we really get any state of kidney disease, feel they wake up in the middle of the night, go peace. And then apart from waking up to peace in the middle of the night, uh, they will also notice say, when they peace. Uh, the peace will come full, like say they put soap inside. Hmm. So that one, it shows you they don't they get small, small protein inside their urine. Wow. And one of people could do to say when they work as small, they go they tired. Or when they climb staircase, they need to rest before they continue to walk. Now, this condition or this symptom, no day, 
people that you can think of. It also happen if somebody gets at Wahala or if somebody gets best Wahala. Okay, mm -hmm. but by the time the thing don't progress, which stage four, stage five, person will notice say you know fit chop well. If it they vomit early in the morning, if All they right. get constant hiccup. All right, the thank body you. will swear. Yeah, thank you, our well, doctor. Yes. Thank you, uh, doctor, for your time because um, I can believe say we always like to get you back again so that you go stress more on this kid the matter because now very extensive thing like the way you did explain now. So, Ben, for you, go for Barbara because of time. But I want to say a big thank you to you, Dr. Theophilus Uma Zudike, will be consultant, transplant physician, and neurologist for our uh, Department of Medicine, LUT. Thank you all for your time what you give us today. All right. Thank you also.